So now I've never seen anything like this. This is a total disgrace. The impeachment hoax too is turning out to be an even bigger disgrace than I thought it was going to be. And I thought it was going to be a very big disgrace. You know, now they're talking about bringing witnesses. It's called due process, okay? You've got to have strong... You got to do the process, okay? You know, I talked to Regent Brett Kavanaugh and he told me, he said, due process, sir. And I said, stop crying, Brett, okay? It's going to be okay. We're going to get the White House back. But he said, you know, the due process. It's when you have a, you got to do a process and they're not doing a process right now. They're doing a, a joke, okay? And now they want to bring witnesses. Whoever, excuse me, whoever heard of a trial, a trial with witnesses. This has never happened before. This is called unprecedented. You know, something that's never happened to a president before. And it's a total disgrace. And now they want to bring witnesses and they're going to subpoena witnesses. And I remember when I was talking to Mike Pence, when we were talking, and he, he got excited. He said, some penises? And I said, no, no, Mike, subpoena. Okay, it's a lot, it's different than what you think it is. And... This could have all been avoided. All could have been. I want peace. I want great peace. All Mike Pence had to do was say, Sir, I'm very sorry for allowing Sleepy Joe to steal the election. Please forgive me. And I would have forgiven him. You know, I have tremendous forgiveness. And I would have said to Mike Pence, It's okay. My supporters will no longer murder you. But, you know, they're going to be standing by and standing back in case you upset me again. And then they're going to bring out the MAGA gallows and they're going to hang you. And not the kind of hangman that you always talk about. Not such a good one. And that would have been it. But now they want to bring witnesses for this fake impeachment hoax. And I tell you this, free speech, if they convict me, my supporters should burn DC to the ground, metaphorically free speech.